So here it is, what we've all been waiting for. Make sure you are strapped in and ready to go. Well, the biggest show in town just now, Peter, and everyone wants to be a part of it. Uh, a competition that seems to draw out the, the whole gamut of emotions. And in keeping with that, we've got an atmosphere with a real sense of enthusiasm here. And um, I'm hoping we get lift off once this game kicks off. And that gets things running. Forward it goes. And Zonzi. Great run on the overlap here. That's a throw. Has a pop! It's there! And Stade René take the lead. I can give the keeper a little sympathy here because I think he might have been slightly unsighted. However, credit where it's due, it's still a fine finish from a tight spot. That Rene grab an early lead. Good start. Well, here is the raid we were told to expect. Kovacic. Kovacic with the crossfield ball. Marcos Alonso drives it towards the front. Defending of the desperate variety. That's an untidy challenge, free kick given. Marcos Alonso gets it away. That's gone a long way up and away. Stade René are very much in charge here, dominating possession and a goal to the good. Goes down, but nothing given. And it's played forward. Tries to get it forward quickly. Oh, they can break here. Hudson Otoy. Marcos Alonso. Marcos Alonso switches it towards the other side. Has a pop! Gets good distance on it. And it's been taken straight back. Across the field it goes. Has he found his man? Danger averted for now. 
Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. Conte. Well, the score's only 1-0, but that doesn't tell the full story. Shapes to shoot! And the defence can get it clear. Marcos Alonso, great leap! Good delivery, but no joy. I have to commend the wing plate, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. And that's sprayed out wide. He's in space and looking for options. Plays it out to the wing. Aimed in towards the centre. Oh, real danger here. There's the shot! And that's it for the first half, a breathless ending. And there we are, off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. I'm sure they'll be very happy with their first-half performance and the scoreline. They'll definitely want to maintain their momentum now and finish the job. Stad René come off having scored the only goal of the game so far. It's been tight, it's been exciting. And there is certainly plenty for us to chew on during the break. And the game has already resumed here. Stad René carrying a one-goal lead. And it's Kovacic. Hoists it forward. Kovacic. Dashing forward at pace. And Zonzi. He's got options out wide. Out of play for a throw. So now we're going to get those changes we have been expecting. Grenier. Jorginho drives it forward. Marcos Alonso. And it's played forward. And no, that is pretty much the end of that. And Zonzi. Up towards the front line. Jorginho plays it forward. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. Kante gets it back. Werner. Your impression so far, Jim? Well, Peter, if they're attempting to see out the game with such a, a narrow advantage, there's room for trouble. Uh, I just think they're sending out the wrong message. This could backfire.
Kepa sends that a long way. The uh, ball needed to be better there. It's a wasted chance. Chelsea showing a little more urgency now. And to be honest, Peter, this is what's required. Well, hit and hope is just about the sum of it, isn't it, Jim? Just has to be done. It's a long pass, but not the most accurate. Rudiger. Gets into a dangerous position. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. Hit into the middle. There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed, but will they? Stad René are on the verge of a pretty special win, but they've got some hanging on to do here. Just brushed off the ball there. Rudiger goes looking. Thiago Silva. They're making life really hard for themselves. The ball needs to be in the mixer, not there. Almost there. And time is up. Pretty much the ideal start. A win on the first day and a platform on which to build. How do you look back on the game then, Jim? Well, pressure can quickly build on you if a positive result isn't achieved in your opening group match. Instead, they can take great confidence now from a very good victory and look ahead with real belief.